I've been in Ukraine now for three days. I was really hoping that when I arrived that, you know, Lana would meet me. Uh, that didn't happen. Lana was too busy. That's what she'll smell when we hug for the first time. The private investigator gave me nothing, literally nothing. He thought I was being scammed. So I don't have any actual proof that she lives here, but I really don't care because I chatted with Lana last night on the website and I told her to meet me at the monument in Independence Square right at 11 a.m. There should be no issues trying to hook up at this point. Did she say she would? She said she would. Did she sound excited? Yes, but she's still very nervous, and I'm starting to feel nervous. I, I did tell her that I was going to wear my black leather coat with, uh, with a gold shirt underneath. For very first meeting, I want to look my best. Lana has told me she will iron my shirts because I've told her how long it takes me, and she says, oh, I can do it three times faster. I'll iron your shirts for you. The private investigator was saying, I don't think she's going to show up. My friends don't think she's going to show up. But I know Lana differently. Uh, Lana is going to get this box of chocolates. She will be getting these special lotions. Uh, and I really hope I can use this in the next week. That would be the hope. I'm going out there to get my girl right now. That's what this is all about. I am going to go get my girl. Looking good. In the past, Lana has failed to meet me because the first time she was much too shy. The second time, her brother died on the day we were supposed to meet. Uh, the third time, she had a medical procedure that took her out of commission for a few weeks. On the fourth time, she got cold feet. But the fifth time for us is hopefully a charm. It's been seven years in the making, thousands of hours of chat. I am beyond ready, but my excitement is being tempered by my nervousness of, of what that first meeting is gonna be like. I want someone who shows affection. Can I get that from just knowing somebody through chat for seven years? This is Independence Square. And the monument that I'm gonna meet her in is right there. I told her 11 o'clock at this spot. There is no room for error on this. I told her to meet me under the monument. Everybody knows Independence Square. Everybody knows the monument. There is only one place that could be. Five more minutes. It's a super cold day. So the good thing is that it's so cold that I don't think anybody's gonna be here. It's just gonna be me and her. Ten fifty-nine. Now I'm starting to get nervous. I don't know what she'll be wearing, but I do remember seeing a photo where she has a bluish gray knit cap. Eleven o'clock. Is that her? Yeah, she wouldn't wait down there. There is another statue across the street. She wouldn't think it was there. Where is Lana? Where is Lana? It's still only 11.07. If she doesn't show up this time, I'm not coming back. I can't go through this again. Is that her? Oh my God. That's her. That is her. <laughs> oh my god.
God. <laughs> Next time on Before the 90 Days. Mario has been constantly texting me. Table for two. I want to put that whole situation behind me. Hi. Hi. I don't know if this relationship is salvageable, but I love her. Here we are. I reached out to Williams. I care about, you know, Williams a lot, and I care about him telling me the truth. Are you still in love with, with me? Mommy's gonna do the miracle mask. I need a miracle in my life right now. Ever since the breakup, I've been empowered. 